One epic summer continues down in Monterey for the Bayonet Black Horse Amateur Championship. Kevin Vello and Craig Roney lead the tournament at two under. Let's tee it off and check out the action. Kevin Bello couldn't get the putts to fall and was burning edges all day. He dropped out of the lead early and couldn't make up the shots late in the round. Craig Roney didn't come out of the gates hot either with bogeys on two and four, but bounced back with birdies on five, eight, 10, and 16 to put him within two of the lead. He got an unfortunate kick after trying to go for it on 18 and ended up with a bogey on the final hole. All right, so Noah, you played a great round today. What'd you shoot? Uh, 300 par, 69. 69, and it was good enough to bring you to four under, just mm -hmm. one shot off the lead today. Yeah. How does it feel uh, taking home second place at this event? Uh, it's my first time in the event, and uh, I've only played the golf course once, so um, with a field like this, it's getting, uh, the field's been really good. Um, so getting seconds means, I mean, it's a pretty big accomplishment for my first year. How do you feel going into the golf season? Um, I'm feeling really good. Um, going into uh, my freshman year, I've played some um, some good golf uh, out here in the U.S. Junior Amateur, and so I have a lot of confidence going into uh, my freshman year to start off. Kevin Cassidy here with AmateurGolf.com. We're at the final round of the Bayonet Black Horse Amateur Championship. We have Finnegan Tilly. You just won with a 4 under 68. Yeah, it was great. Uh, just had to stick to the game plan basically the whole round. I knew that Bayonet would. Uh, put up a big fight. It's a tough course and was able to get some short birdie putts to take the nerves off. Uh, birdie 10, 11, 12 sort of made me relax and cruised in from there and then had a nice birdie on 17 after a bogey on 16 and you know that, that made me feel real comfortable coming into 18. So you came down here a couple weeks ago for US Amateur qualifying. Did you get a little bit better feel for the course coming into here? Yeah, yeah and I know playing with Playing two rounds in a day, I could see where people struggle, what holes are easy, and um, that sort of helped me to, you know, know what holes to attack and what holes to play it safe. It was, it was, it was very helpful. When you cut, when you were coming into the final round, could you picture yourself holding that trophy? Yeah, I could, but I, I still had to stick to my game plan. And coming into 18, I definitely had a sense and it feels great. Being a cow bear, that's got to help the team out a little bit, winning tournaments in the off season. You know, more cow and KK have been playing great also. So what, what, what will that help you coming into your fall season? Uh, yeah, that will give us a lot of confidence. Uh, I love playing with those guys. They got a lot of experience winning and holding trophies. So I'll be asking them questions and lean on each other and try to have a really good season.